I've met now. Bol. Bol is one of several small villages on the island of Brach, which is easily accessible by catamaran from the city of Split. When you arrive at the dock by boat or by bus, you can visit the over 100-year-old Stina winery in the building for the first Dalmatian winemaking association, Prva Damatinska Vinarska Zadrushka. Bol is most famous for Zlatni Rat, which means golden cape. It's the beach which has been consistently rated as the best beach in Croatia and one of Europe's best as well. It's a rocky beach which changes with the movements of the tide. In fact, the beach keeps growing, its point jutting out into the Adriatic a few more meters every year. Now, I love going to the beach here, and if you are so inclined, you could even go to the clothing optional part of the island. Walking along the beach, you might catch some taxi boats or small catamarans shuttling passengers around on day trips. Or you might discover some souvenirs on the more fashionable side, or take home some edible gifts like honey, rakia, cherries, or figs. Apart from the little bit of street art in Bowl, you can also purchase artistic souvenirs made from the island's white stone or simply absorb the artistic creativity of any of the gleaming limestone carvings you witness along the riva that reaches Zlatni Rat. Now this famous limestone is quarried all over Brach Island. In fact, white stone from Brach was used to build both the White House in the United States and Diocletian's palace in Split. Now for a stroll away from the beach, there are a few churches in Bol made of the same white stone, including St. Peter and Paul, which is over three centuries old, and Our Lady of Carmel. So in my opinion, the town's best restaurant is Mali Rai, where I met this brilliant dude Hervoye and had a quite amazing dish of tagliatelle with kozice and pine nuts, and a super top-notch cherny risotto with a crispy parmesan cheese basket. Mali Rai also served this incredible dessert called Nedovrashena Lyubav, Unfinished Love, which features apples cooked in maraschino liqueur, vanilla cream, and these crispy threads, a little bit of uh, almond as well. Absolutely delicious. And like any good konoba, Mali Rai makes its own olive oil using olives grown in its own olive garden. Last funny thing about Mali Rai is that the owner has great taste in sculptures. You should see what treasures are inside. <laughs> One thing I really enjoy about taking an evening stroll around Bol is to see the pink and purple ribbons in the sky and the town's many boats in the harbor. Hey, if you've been to Bol, let me know in the comments below. You need to visit and you need to check out all the town's treasures. <laughs> Once again, thanks for watching. Fala Puno e Vidimose.